everybody, I'm Bree the Plant Lady. Today I want to talk to you about conquering cabbage worms using Bt. If you're not familiar, Bt is Bacillus thuringiensis. It's a gram-positive bacterium that's labeled as organic and it enables you to target very specifically the caterpillars that are eating some of your favorite food crops like cabbage, cauliflower, Brussels sprouts, broccoli, um, let's see, collards, kale, anything in the Brassicaceae family. Now, the cabbage worms at this season can be really difficult to spot because they're tiny and they're green, but you will notice them based off of the holes that they start to create in your brassica plants. Now, the easiest way to deal with this is to apply Bt. You can do liquid Bt or I like powder Bt. The reason I like powder is simply because I can see that I've applied it. So the process is really easy. I'm just going around gently, kind of scattering this powder around on all of the plants that are in the brass KCE family. So here I have a big row of cauliflower. On this side, I have Brussels sprouts and cabbage. Up here, I have broccoli. And behind me, I have more broccoli. So I'm gonna put this dust on everything and that's gonna give me some protection for the next, say, eight to 10 days. So here is the perfect example. I can tell that a caterpillar is here because look at the leaves are all deformed and eaten. And here are the caterpillars and there's two. There's a big thick one right here in the mid vein and then there's a baby. And I can't control myself, I have to squeeze them. When I find them, I have to squeeze them. So the way BT works is really great. The caterpillars eat this bacterium and they feel full and then they stop eating and they starve to death. And I think it's really important that you recognize there is a super big difference between a pest and a pollinator. And cabbage worms are not a pollinator. They're also called cabbage loopers. And these are the tiny little white butterflies. They're not butterflies, they're moths that you see floating around and all they're doing is laying eggs. So if you like to grow cool season crops, cabbage worms do not benefit you to any capacity but BT will help combat this issue. These cabbage worms are the main reason that people don't get proper cabbage heads to develop when they're growing cabbage at home. And it's really funny how some plants in my garden are totally clean. Although look, I was saying that and look, there's a cabbage worm right there. Cute little broccoli growing as well. So you can see, I grow a lot of brassica plants at this time of year in the spring. I actually grow them all winter long. But spring and fall are the main times where the cabbage worms are really active. So you wanna just pay attention and apply BT on a regular basis. So if you're like me and you like to grow your own broccoli, cauliflower, and cabbage, but struggle to deal with cabbage worms. Buy a bag of BT and apply it. Please subscribe to Breathe the Plant Lady for more practical gardening tips and give this video a thumbs up if you found it helpful. Thanks so much for watching everyone.